Welcome back to the channel. Uh, we have some new subscribers. If you don't know, we uh, sold everything. We travel uh, the country with a rock crawler. Uh, we live in this camper. We've been to some amazing places across the country, rock crawling and just sightseeing. Our, on our way back home, our motor blew up. And then, so now we've been home and we're here to tell you uh, what's next and where we're going from here. Yeah, we're gonna bring you up to speed on some things and let you know what we're doing with the buggy. It needs a makeover. Uh, what we're dealing with since my mother's death and what our long-term plans are with this channel that we never expected to be like this. So let's take a walk. So if this is your very first time watching us and your very first video, we're doing a giveaway for some Mojab straps and first aid kit. So if you wanna get in on that, you have one week left. Go watch the uh, Good Evening Ranch video and the instructions are in that video to tell you how to win. And again, you have one week left and then we'll be drawing that randomly. One of the things we wanna address in in the last 28 days alone, we're over 2,600 new subscribers. So I don't expect everybody to go back that far, but we've been all over, like she said in the intro, we've been to some incredible places. The buggy's take, taken a beating over the last year or more of wheeling nearly every single weekend. So we got a video coming out in the future about how we maintain the buggy. While I'm here in North Carolina, I do, I do have a guy warrior welding who works on it and uh, we're gonna do some stuff together and make some content there also uh in the meantime i'm an accountant we don't just uh do this without any money coming in so i work um part-time but full-time during uh january and april accountants okay. live eat and breathe taxes during that time so that's kind of what i've been doing during this time before we roll back out again for our next adventure Philip's mom passed away right before Christmas um, unexpectedly. And I just feel like we were kind of like meant to come back here, you know, cause the motor blew up on our way back. We were supposed to be on the Gulf of Alabama right now, enjoying the warm weather and the beaches. But our motor blew up and God placed us back home so that he could be here to see his mom and deal with some of the things that he's dealing with now. Which is actually quite the mess. If you look here, this was the property next door to my mom's house. It was a rental property. All of that falls on me. Plus there was people living in my mom's house with her when she passed away. And um, we're having issues with that to say the least. If you want to know the details, leave a comment. And when I can legally speak on that, I will. Okay, so Philip, after his mom passed in, has inherited all of his property, all of his mom's property and belongings. And so, you know, anybody who's ever done that, not only is it emotional, but it's it's a big project to go through and, and tackle. So we're um, we're gonna stay here a couple of months and uh, work through some of that. And it came along with it its own problems. And we'll probably chronicle some of that because there's gonna be some repairs involved and some hurdles that we're gonna have to get past. Uh, so yeah, so follow along for that. And then uh, our eventual after all that's over with our eventual plan, as we said in another video where we went over uh, what we're doing with the truck. So uh, clip back to that one here. We're gonna roll out at the end of April to uh, go to some cool places and some uh, really awesome off-roading uh, parks. And we're gonna go to one of our favorite places again, uh, Rugged Mountain Ranch. So we're like counting down the days to that. So we do intend to continue to travel. We're just kind of stationary in North Carolina until April. We're getting back out on the road, as Lindsay said. We're gonna travel for a whole other year. Lindsay is actually going to Disney World tomorrow, or today, Yay! if you're watching this, today she is in Disney World now. So we've been wandering around because we don't know how to film this informative stuff and keep it interesting, but we do have a storage unit. We gotta go deal with some things. And I wanna share with you some of the long-term stuff that's gonna go on on this channel, like I'm filming some stuff with a certain buggy builder, and there's a lot to come. I am thinking long-term. So let's go to our storage unit, and I'm gonna tell you more about that. We haven't been by this storage unit in a while because we've been in denial about what's actually in here. When you, you pack up everything, sell your house in less than a month, you gotta put some of the stuff somewhere, and it's embarrassing almost. That's embarrassing. <laughs> the thing is, after being on the road for a year, 
we don't need any of the stuff that we thought that we needed here. We just haven't had the time, or do we have the time now? Looks <sighs> like we're dealing with his mom's property to even go through any of this stuff. So if you're still watching this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button and give us a like. That tells YouTube that people like our content and more people will see our content. Yeah, there's just straight junk in here that we would not keep when we settle down. So speaking of settling down, that's what I was going to talk about. I don't even know what she's looking for. She probably told me a bunch. I did tell you a bunch. Honestly, I forgot she was leaving until today. So my wife and daughter is going to be gone for the next couple of days and uh, it's just going to be me and Elias. That just occurred to me to this morning and she leaves in the morning as of recording this. Anyways, what do we plan to do long term? Well, we never intended to be on YouTube and enjoy it and then grow like we have. So we we think that we would wind up with, uh, with like a barn dominium type deal. I don't know. We'll see where we're at a year from now, what land costs and just what's happening in our lives in the next 10 months to a year from now. So we've been looking and that's kind of what our dream is you know our goal and i think we would take you on that whole journey as we make over property and set all that stuff up but in all of that know that we will also be traveling too so yeah that's a year from now ideally if that's part of god's plan you know we just pray about it and continue to travel for now it's what we feel led to do and that's our intentions and uh we're just going to keep traveling for a little while but we do want to settle down on a piece of land and probably do a bardo type deal where do you think we should settle down i'm thinking east tennessee western north carolina southern kentucky southeast virginia somewhere like that all right well Lindsay can't find the bag that she needs and i'm gonna have to actually do something and climb up in this horrendous storage unit so if you're new here and you only found us recently this was probably not a fun video if you watch the whole thing but for our core followers that kind of keep up with everything and new people that do want to be those people, is it weird to assume we have those new people? You people, we just want to share what we're doing because we, there's just a lot going on we're right now. We're just kind of in a period of like, everything's up in the air and we're just Life. kind of taking it week by week. But uh, we wanted everybody to follow us to know like our long-term plans, so. Yeah, we're going to keep on doing this YouTube journey, and um, we appreciate everyone that loves to keep up with it, and we're just going to see where it goes, and we'll see you soon.